Greetings, cities of Almy, Bear River, Woodruff, Randolph, Wyoming, and Utah. Just uh, a little bit north of Evanston, Wyoming. Greetings, I come to you in the name of the Lord with a message. Repent and be baptized, for the kingdom of heaven is near. As nice it is as it is here, beautiful and spacious skies, and nice land, wide open, horses and everything. You cannot be saved by beauty. You cannot be saved by living in a beautiful place. It's a shame, but it's true. How can you be saved? Only by faith. Only by faith in Jesus Christ, our Savior, who died on the cross for, for each one of us. So that we may live, but we only uh, live if we accept the gift. If we renounce our sins. So first of all, you have to accept that you're a sinner. And that's hard for some people, some who are good citizens, especially for those who are good citizens. Pay their taxes, don't break the laws, never even got a parking ticket. You're thinking, what, me? I'm not a sinner. Well, you are. We're all sinners even just for because of original sin, but also because of sins of commission or sins of omission. And I don't want to get too complicated, but just trust me. Ask any Christian, any pastor. Uh, they'll, they'll let you know. We're all sinners. And so, if you're ready to say, I'm sorry, Jesus, for my sin. And by the way, every person knows they're a sinner in their heart of hearts. But sometimes their heart becomes hardened, so they don't even... They don't even know it. They don't. I mean, they know it, but they've denied it. They're in denial. They, they've it's sunk so down deep inside them. So it takes a while for it to come back out. That's why we have to keep preaching and keep repeating some of the same things. So if you're ready to say, I'm sorry for my sins, thank you for dying to save me, I welcome you into my heart and commit my life to you, then I baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. You are now a Christian here in the wide open land of Utah and Wyoming, Highway 89, towards Jackson. Congratulations. And there's a lot more to tell you, but I can't say it all here and now, and so make sure you read the box below. And if you have any questions or for a free Bible, message me on YouTube. And I'll be praying for you, and I also want to encourage you all to, any of you who are already Christians, keep growing and going. Keep doing as your best you can. Don't go weary of doing good. Your labor for the Lord is not in vain. God be with you all and bless you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen.